Hey guys, this is Lawrence from buildmyecommerce.com. OpenCart 2.0 has been officially released, so I downloaded the installation files and poked around. In this video, I'll be pointing out some major differences between OpenCart 1.5 and 2.0 for the front and back end without going into every single detail because I just downloaded the installation file and I need more time to test all the new features. First thing you notice is the much cleaner and modern look for the front end. And pages load faster compared to the previous version. Let me show you. By using the GT metrics, you will notice the improved performance over the OpenCart 1.5. The part I love the most with 2.0 is the responsive design, which means your web store will look great across multiple devices. Let's take a look using the emulator. Here is the iPhone. Let's go ahead and load the OpenCart 2.0 homepage. As you can see, everything fits nicely. Now let's compare this to the previous version, which just breaks down when used with mobile devices. Here is the OpenCart 1.5 back end. And this is the new OpenCart 2.0. Looks amazing, right? They totally redesigned the back end. Now you can clearly see total orders, sales, customers, and people online at the top. I made few test orders, and this map here will show you in the darker blue color where the order was placed, which is a nice little feature. This can be useful if you do any advertising. You may want to target those countries where a majority of your orders are coming from if you sell internationally. The menu has been moved to the left and you can collapse and uncollapse by clicking on this icon at the top left corner. A couple of new features I noticed are the marketing and extension installer. The marketing tracking allows you to track and determine the quality of the campaigns you are running. As an example, Let's create a new campaign by clicking this plus icon. Give it a name. I'll just call it Amazon.com Advertising and leave the tracking code. Here, not only can you see the number of clicks, but you can see the orders from those clicks. This is a very powerful feature because you can determine which campaigns are successful. In the extensions section, you now have the extension installer, which is a time-saving feature. In the previous version, you had to upload the third-party extensions manually to install. But now, you can do that directly from the back-end without using File Manager or FTP program. So that is my overview of the OpenCart 2.0. You guys can download the installation file from the OpenCart website. So check it out. If you plan to upgrade your current store, I would wait since it would take time for the developers to upgrade third-party extensions. I plan to release a few more videos for OpenCart 2.0 soon, so make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel.